journey begins. Alright, 84 Lumber was one of the most talked about Super Bowl commercials in 2017. Uh, a commercial that depicts a mother and her daughter um, on their journey from South America to the United States. Um, this commercial was banned by Fox News for being too controversial, but then it was edited and aired during the Super Bowl. The commercial begins with a mother and daughter embarking on some sort of journey. We see them leaving their house at an early hour and getting in a truck. The use of Kairos lets us know that they are immigrants. They get in the truck with other immigrants and embark on a dangerous journey from Mexico to the United States. During this journey, we watch them struggle through inclement weather, um, not knowing if they're gonna reach their destination or not, or even that they know what their destination is. This is an emotional appeal to the viewers to uh, our humanity, whether or not we have a specific political view about this topic, or um, anything about 84 Lumber itself. As the journey continues, we watch them approach a wall which strikes a chord with the viewers because of the current political climate. We watch the mother and daughter walk into the light as the wall opens and it ends on a happy note. At the very end of the commercial is the first time we see 84 Lumber's logo and then the commercial ends. No message can be complete without the context of the story, and this holds especially true for Lumber's 84 commercial. Um, they, uh, the Fox News executives had banned a previous uh, version of the commercial, uh, which led to much anticipation among the viewers and to find out what would cause such controversy for a simple commercial. Political divisiveness at the time was very powerful in how the message was received to the viewer. Whether or not you were for or against the wall, uh, if you were for it, you would look at the wall as a sign of security. And when they went through the doors, you would most likely tend to think that it represents a way of entering to America legally. Uh, but it does. There does need to be some security. However, if you were against the, uh, the wall, you would immediately just look at the wall and see it as a sign of separation and separating a group of people. Uh, Maggie Hardy Majerko, uh, she didn't intend it to be a political commercial. However, that is pretty much how it was viewed as uh, in the viewer's eyes. Uh, she saw the wall also as a sign of security the uh, backlash from social media that she received clearly was a sign that the message was received two very different ways. Now to talk about the usage of logos, ethos, and pathos within the 84 Lumber commercial. Starting off with logos. You do not see the name of the company or even a mention of the company until the very end. One reason 84 Lumber may have used this technique is they know by the end of the commercial people want to know who produced it. Going on to ethos. While watching the ad, you see the little girl collecting material on her journey to create the American flag, which I believe is supposed to represent the American dream and the company's patriotism. By stating this, it allows some viewers to develop trust with 84 Lumber. Pathos is the strongest appeal found in this commercial. By using a mother and daughter, viewers relate to their own mothers, grandmothers, aunts, daughters, and little sisters, and so on. This ability to relate to them makes people want good things to happen to them, which, pe which will make people go and look for the longer version of the commercial. The more that people watch the longer commercial, the more successful the commercial is. This advertisement heavily uses emotional appeal. 84 Lumber takes advantage and uses social appeal in the fact that the current state of our nation is divided on many different political views, including possible new immigration laws and reforms that could include a wall bordering Mexico. By knowing their ad will be controversial, 84 Lumber knows it will be, get more publicity. The purpose of this commercial was to attract young people to, to the lumber business. Before the commercial, a lot of people didn't know about the company, especially people 40 and younger. 
but now after the commercial has been aired, so many viewers went on the company's website to see the unedited version of the commercial. The moving depiction of, the, of a mother and daughter's journey from Mexico to the U.S. appealed to the emotions of its viewers, and that's why so many people wanted to see the full version of the commercial.